Hi scientists, I'm going to show you a few things on balancing that looks pretty magical. It uh, could be really simple, like if you've got a ruler like this, we know that the middle of the ruler is a good place for it to balance, but if you want to find that, put your two fingers from each of your hands on the opposite ends, and then if you just slide your fingers towards one another, I'm not doing anything special, I'm just trying to make them go towards one another, they naturally join right at the center where this will balance. And that just happens on its own. If I put one finger in between where my two fingers were, I can see that balance point really is working. And it also works for bigger objects, like my meter stick. So same idea. I think that the meter stick is gonna balance right in the middle, but I don't have to think about it. It just shows that my fingers join at that one spot that happens to be the 50 centimeter mark. But more amazing is that if I take this same meter stick and I put some extra weights on one side, now of course it's not balanced, but my trick, well let's just see, it still shows that the fingers join at one spot that balances, but the 50 centimeter mark is right here. My fingers are just a little bit short of the 60 centimeter mark. The wind makes it a little bit more exciting. And this should happen for any kind of weird object. Wooden spoon, it's got more stuff here than it's got here, I think, but I can test it by sliding my fingers together. Oops, I'll go on the grouper wheel by sliding my fingers together. And sure enough, Balance is right about there. Do it one more time. There we go. And it doesn't even have to be objects that you would have inside your house in a reasonable way. It could also be something you just pick up out of the shed. This is a really strange shaped object, but it's got a balance point too that my fingers show me. I tried to put my fingers here, it wouldn't work. I tried to put my fingers here, it wouldn't work. But if I just let my fingers slide together, naturally they just kind of give and slide until they meet in this balance point right in between. So there you go, this should work with any object, brooms, sticks,